What's going on guys? Stiff here with a special Mutt player review. We are going to be going over the 95 overall dual style master Ryan Kerrigan with specialties in style for pass rush and man defense who also gives his players plus one XL to everybody on the field. I just got this guy yesterday, just got my hands on him, played around five games with him, and let me tell you, he is a beast. Let's get into those stats. So, he's 6'4 to begin with, 87 speed, which is pretty decent, 92 strength, 95 acceleration, which is 96 because he's plus one, 90 tackle, 91 play recognition, 92 block shed, 93 pursuit, 76 zone coverage, which is really good, and not to mention he has 96 hit power, which is not on the card. Wish he had 90 speed because some of these elite linebackers coming out now have 90 speed but I can't really get too picky with him his play recognition is pretty good maybe you wish it was a 95 because Luke Keekley's is a 98 but still gives that plus one acceleration to everyone on the team cannot complain at all uh, if you're trying to find him he may be limited in the auction block since not a lot of players can get the dual style yet they didn't really get the uh the rising stars in order to complete it or they don't have enough coins to get the the RTTP players anyway it's not uh a review about how to get the how to get the dual style challenge review on the player he's going to cost roughly i think around 500k i want to say around 500k maybe 450 i saw him going for he was selling for but uh not really too much i mean the Derek brooks is starting to go down to that level anyway but i think this kerrigan's card looks cooler <laughs> and so far he plays pretty good i haven't played with Derek brooks so i can't really attest to him and as you saw the first play right there, we got Ryan Kerrigan in the backfield tackling him with that 91 player recognition, trying to strip the ball out from the running back. And right there, he was also in another play making the big time tackle. And we got fourth down and we stripped the ball out with Luke Keekley and turnover on downs. So anyway, to go over this uh, Ryan Kerrigan, because this, this is the player mutt review about him. Uh, you'll see me using him more right now, and I'll start to go over things that I like about him. Uh, his agility. He's got very good agility. You could really go left and right with him really quickly. Um, for some reason, I think his ball hawk is different than everyone else's. Uh, uh, holding the ball hawk, I feel like he warps to the ball better. That's just my opinion. I've only really played five games with him. So I really can't say anything about ball hawking, but that's just something that I've noticed. Another thing that I've noticed with him is when you're not playing on him, he reacts to the, the plays better. Um, just my personal opinion, he goes to the ball, as you saw from that first play, he just dove right in there, didn't pass him, he just dove right in there. Um, you'll see coming up that his hit stick is pretty lethal. He gets those hit sticks down and down again. Uh, I haven't really made anyone fumble with them yet, but then again, like I said, only five games in with them, but he does. He's just so fluid. He's almost like my Luke Keekly. And right there, there's an example of that big hitting power we got right there. Just slams the receiver back, and then we, we come up with a... I don't even know what he did. He just dumbed out on that play. I'm not exactly sure what happened. Gets a good hit stick, and then he dumbs out on a play. Uh, probably because I was holding ball hawk and something with the AI got messed up. But anyway, that was really the only flaw that I saw with him this game. You'll see right here he's hurrying up. He comes down to the fourth down. He tries hitting his tight end, and we lurk and give me that one time with Ryan Kerrigan. He's got like 75 catching, I believe. I used to have Justin Houston in that position. He had 40 catch, so having 76 catches is a, is a delight. And like I said before, I was just holding Y, ball hawk, fish. He just, feet, he just seemed to just uh, warp to the ball better and just got the interception. So anyway, 21-0, uh, pretty much desperation by this guy. Gets the onside kick, I, ends up, I end up getting it. But if I had to give a 1 through 10 overall review for Ryan Kerrigan, give him a 9.3 just because I don't want to give him a 10, just because there will be better linebackers out there later in, at the end of the year. But we're just going to get one more interception. Give me that two times with Rashad Jones. That's going to seal it up. He's going to end up quitting. So the overall grade I give for Ryan Kerrigan is 9.3. He's just like my Luke Keekley. Love my Luke Keekley. Love lurking with him. Just wish they had uh, 90 plus speed. That's about it. But I'll, I'll lurk a lot of interception with this guys.
So make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe for some more player reviews. Till next time, guys. Adios.